Well, hey guys, <clears throat> how's it going? Um, still working on the 70. I got a video. I'm trying to upload where me and Lars is working on this thing. Uh, but in the last 24 hours, man, it's got really cold here in Tennessee. Uh, so I'm out here shunting bits on the house. Uh, trying to make sure the pipes don't do nothing. Yeah. Make sure the pipes don't freeze. That kind of thing. Um, I got something right there that I've let fly. And I should have had that done. But we'll get back to car stuff here in a minute. And I'll explain some things. But I got to get these vents closed or else I'll end up with some frozen pipes here in a little while and we really don't want that because I hate crawling up under this house I got two to go hang on let's get this done yeah my air conditioning unit went kaput about three years ago and they were talking sixteen thousand dollars so we just put a couple of you know window units in Ugh. but hopefully at some point i'll make enough money to replace this thing all right so Let's head back around the house here. And I'm telling you, man. I was thinking, you know, I'd have at least a couple more weeks. So it usually don't get cold around here until uh, about middle of December. But evidently, we're going to get a cold front through here in the next few days. And they're talking snow on monday uh snow on wednesday that kind of thing so here we go we're back at the truck had to put some antifreeze in that thing because you know, it was straight water was flushing that thing out if you you know the last video uh can't let this thing sit here and freeze uh which they're probably ain't gonna get that cold but he was worried about it so stuck a little antifreeze in there i'm gonna check it in a little bit man i can get it down to where it's good till uh somewhere around zero it's very seldom right here it gets that cold. Um, but yeah, we was having some carburetor issues on that last video. Uh, it was flooding and we running out of gas. Well, I'll try to get that thing uploaded here in the next little bit and you can kind of see what happened. Uh, but that's about it, man. Uh, I do have all the shocks off the back. Uh, had to take an aim grinder and cut them off. Uh, still ain't got the back springs on. Um, gonna have to take the tires off to get them. And Lord have mercy, that's gonna be a mess. Uh, did get the tracking arm off of it. Sorry, I'm going in the house. I'm in the shop, man. It's cold. Um, they get the tracking arm off of it. And here's the new tracking arm. Uh, it's not bent. And a bag full of crap. I don't know what all's in this thing. Uh, I know there's a seat belt in there. There's supposed to be stuff that goes in the steering column. Uh, all kind of crap. Um, 
that kind of stuff. Um, but that carburetor messed with my head. Uh, it was running out of gas. The dang thing, the next day I put gas in it. Well, when we was working on it, put gas in it. I mean, it was blowing gas out of every orifice that carburetor had. Um, I beat on it, banged on it, you know, took the fuel filter and stuff out of it, throw some compressed air through it, trying to get that needle seat, you know, to get down where it's supposed to. And that was last night. No, it didn't work out too good. Uh, it was still flooding like crazy, man. Just gas everywhere. Today I go out, started up to put this antifreeze and stuff in there after I drained everything out. The thing sitting out there running perfect. I, I don't know. But hey, wait for that other video, man, when we was doing all that stuff. And I don't know why I can't upload it. It might be a little long, so I might have to cut some stuff out of it. But there you go. Uh, I'm, we're still tinkering with this 70. And so. As of January, it'll be a solid year working on this truck. Uh, so I'm kind of skeptical, if you know what I mean, about people going and picking these things up out of the barn and, you know, uh, they run fine and that kind of stuff. There's evidently a bunch of stuff going on behind the scenes that you don't see. Because this thing's been nothing but a nightmare. Uh, but we're down to the end of it. But now we're back in the cold season. I think around here it ain't supposed to get out of the 40s. I know you people up north just laugh at us, but we're not used to that kind of weather. Uh, 50s. I can handle, I can handle 40s. I got no clothes I can do that. But uh, when she hits about 30 degrees outside, man, I'm about done working outside. Uh, but anyway, uh, hope everything's going good in your world. Everything's great. Uh, I just got to do some more editing on this video where we was working on it last night. Uh, get you caught up on what we all done. Uh, eh, besides that, man, we'll see you on the next one. Just hopefully I'll get that done here in the next couple of hours and get that loaded up.